Greetings in the name of Allah. How is your health? It's been a while since we heard from you. Baba and the rest of your siblings extend their greetings. The reason why I am writing is to discuss a very important issue with you that I thought we cannot discuss on the phone. And it is issue of your getting married. Baba and I discovered that you have come of age and to be handed out to a man. So we embarked on a search for a man that will befit you. From your many suitors, we came to an agreement that Musa, al Haji Yakubu's son, the one that owns the largest granite plantation in Kano, was the best suitor for you. So Baba and I have asked him to come and pay you a visit in Lagos. I pray you receive and treat him well because you know we have a lasting relationship with his parents. Call me if you need details. May Allah continue to protect you. as alaikum for your loving mom. Hey guys, I just remember though, I was chatting with my colleague in the office today and he was telling me that our parents are planning on arranging a sister's wedding to a man of their choice. Mm -mm. I really don't think that thing is right. And what makes that wrong? Our parents have been in marriage for years and I feel they should be in the best position to choose a good husband whenever they see one. Chichi. Huh? I don't believe you just said that. At your level of education, you should have more reasoning than that. I mean, whatever happened to falling in love with a man first before marriage? I wonder. Eh? Love develops. By the time both of them start living together, there's this bond that attached them. Which bond? Hey, Chichi. Mm -hmm. Take a while and listen to yourself. Do you know the joy of getting married to someone that you love? First your friend, then your confidant, and then your companion. Mm. I beg. Um, Tola, mm? you've just been keeping silent. What is your own mm. opinion on this matter? <sighs> well, I am indifferent. If a young lady is stupid enough to marry a man chosen for her by her parents, mm -hmm. mm, then she's free to do so. And on the other hand, if she's wise enough to choose her own life partner, then why not? 
Marriage is a personal thing if you ask me. I quite agree with you because me, personally, lie, 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 I will never agree to an arranged marriage at all. Oh, never. Never. Hey, I even forgot to tell you. Guess who I saw today? With one 16 year old girl clinging so closely to his side. Who? Hmm, you won't believe it. Clifford Daddy. What is wrong with that old fool? Eh? How can he be seen around town with his daughter's age mates? He needs fresh blood. Eh? What kind of dirty fresh blood is that? Some men are so shameless. At almost 70. Now shame me, they talk. You know, talk make it for no down on top of the girl. <laughs> but now, wow, girls of nowadays are very bold. How can a 16 year old girl be dating a man that is over 60? In fact, look at the age difference. The right question, my dear, is why should single ladies date married men? I mean, where's the future in that? We are the single guys, eh? What is the difference? Marry, they're no green marry. <laughs> my sister, that is not a lie. But you see, the girls of these days really don't care about their future. All they are concerned about is their pockets. Men don't teach them strong, strong lesson. At whose detriment? Look, most of this married men that go after single girls walk around with hideous sexual diseases that they share generously. I hope you have proof of that. Most of these old men are willing to take you as their second wife. That is if you agree why the young men are chasing after old women for their money. That's what is in vogue now with our men. And we are for what? Testing. <laughs> Ladies, where do we start? The single men don't want to marry us. And the married men are chasing us. What do we do? My sister, you get us a beautiful. Hey, hey, what is this world turning into? Mm. Eh? But do you know, to a very, very large extent, I blame the parents and boyfriends of these girls for not giving them proper orientation. Don't be too hasty to blame it on the parents. Look, most of those girls come from very responsible homes. It is um, greed and materialism that has blinded their sense of reasoning. I don't even want to talk about the economy. That one is a different thing altogether. Tola, eh, I agree with you. But do you know that these parents are totally not innocent of what is happening? I am telling you, I know of some parents who pimp their daughters out to men for money and other valuables. We men have completely lost their virtue. That is why any man that feels he makes a few extra nairas can sleep with any woman. Wow, guys, enough of this boring lecture. I need to go get a pink dress for my date. And yes, he's a married man. At least, luckily for me, it's the first date I have had in like six months. Yes. And it feels so good to be loved by even a married man. So, if you know of any single guy that is willing to have a date with me, please let me know now. Or forever hold your peace. Please, let's go. Let's go and then leave them. Just see me now. Okay. Okay.
Okay, I'm in the house, Musa. It's okay. You need a house, Abu? Yeah. I... I am not going to be able to do it. I am not going to be able to do it. Musa. Kaga, Niko. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Back home. I'm going to be able to do it. I'm going to be able to do it. Why are you going to be able to do it? Ah, ah. So, you know what? I love you very well. Because I'm going to be able to do it. Because I'm going to be able to do it. Zamu ya awalamu mata guda daya guda bi guda oku kisa ni kitengi na yari ya erekarama ulai tala ni kisoni yai kina zuka sana masoni ulai masoni Musa kana jiko eh kaskia ni sepi na tu Abu Bakar bana sunka ulai tala ulai I don't want problem fa kaskia to inda inda haki ni to ba lepi to se yangu ma. It's just a relative. Oh, really? Well, the guy is kind of cute. So, what's his name? And how come we've never heard of him? Um, came for business. Anyway, we hardly see ourselves because he doesn't stay here. We hardly, you know, so. Mm. So, what did he come for? He's um, actually here on business, then um, we had the message from home for me. Yeah, really? Mm. Hello. Ah, Mama, you are here. Sapi. Hey, Mama, look here, pa. Sapi, so, so why, why do you want to bring shame upon this family like this? Mama Banganiba, I don't understand, Pa. Why did you tell Musa you don't want to marry him? Do you know how hard your father and I tried to make this marriage work? Mama, to Allah, kia kurifa, bana sunshi. Kuma is married, I don't want to be a second wife. Hala ila. What well, so when has it become a big deal to be a second wife, Sabi? Gashukma, the first wife, has no child for him. You will have the opportunity to bear him children that will inherit his wealth. Mama, the unlike. Sapi Natu. Sapi Natu. Guess care you will do as you're told. Kinji Kwon? Kuma, no more questions. Kinji? Did I make myself clear, Sapi Natu? Hey, Mama. So. She just stepped out to buy a few things. She'll be back soon. All right. Okay. Sir, sorry, please. We didn't get your name. Oh, I am Musa, son of Olaji Yakubu. He's a cousin, so he's Emia. Ah, Emia of Kanu. But Safi didn't tell us she was related to the Emia. Uh, she is not related. I am. But I thought she said both of you were related. I mean... No. I am here from Kanu, I mean, to plan our wedding. Is there anything the matter? Okay, okay. okay. You see, you see, Sapina too says she never likes me, but I, I, I like her so much. You see, I have a, a, a farm of a granite farm, big granite farm over there, and I have plenty cattle. Okay. Mm. All right. You help me. You talk to her. Okay, sir. Yes, sir. We understand. Sir. Okay. Yes, sir. So we'll when I come back, I, I will let you be happy. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you very, very much. much. Hell! So Safi has been lying to us all this while. But Safi is not this kind of person now. I wonder why she lied. I think there's more to this story than we know. My dear, there is nothing to this story that we don't already know. Safi Nato is getting married very soon. I mean, that the husband console. 
Meanwhile, she didn't lie saying I won't cause it like that. Hey! My dear sister, the best thing that will happen to us is that let us just go and look for solution to this matter. You understand now? Who will find our own husband? Hmm. Chioma. Chioma! My dear. I tell God, beg you. I'm not ready for your lament in this evening. I beg, wait. It'll be like saying I'm funded. Come, I'll not just get power from your nose. What is wrong? I'm talking to you girls. My dear Safi, the question here is why are you lying to us? I mean to yourself! Where is that coming from? Musa was here. Sorry girls, it's, it's not what you're thinking. Safi, how could you lie to us about him like that? Oh, so because we don't have a guy of our own, you think we'll be jealous? Un contre? No, it's not like that. I just can't come to terms to, with what my parents are forcing me to do. I cannot rely. But what is wrong with Musa? Eh? It's kind of cute, you know. Comes from a royal family and <laughs> royal money everywhere. You see, Choma, that is the problem. My parents want me to get married to him so that they can belong to the royal family. They don't even care about what I think or how I feel. And they don't care that he's even married. Really? Eh? Well, Musa didn't tell us he had a wife. You see. He will not tell you because it is not a problem to him. I mean, in my culture, it is allowed to get married to more than one wife, you know, and I'm just not caught out for that sort of life. And besides, I am too civilized for it. Peskia. But Sefinatu, the truth of the matter is that the choice of a life partner is yours. Not even your parents can change that. Ne. Hey, anyway, eh? sorry I was rude to you earlier. Really, I don't mean it. No, I should be the one apologizing. I'm really sorry, girls, if I lied to you. I didn't mean to, because I didn't, I didn't mean to. I didn't know how to handle it and how you girls would take it if I tell you. I'm really sorry it won't happen again. Now we know. <coughs> Please help me beg Chichi now. And she should just. I want to buy one top for me. I'll give her money later. Chichi, you give her now. Give her what? Huh. Why money no day? Me. But now, why? Wow. Not but why you have all of these now? I don't know. Today don't know me. Money for hand. I don't owe you money before. I think it's all on the game. Mm -hmm. I thought I made myself clear on this issue. Why do you have to make me come here? I didn't mean for all this to happen. To happen. What to happen, What to happen, What to happen, Safina? What to happen, Safina? What to happen, Safina? What to happen, to regret you staying in Lagos? Uh, 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 Don't you stay in Lagos? I made you forgot who you are. How dare you refuse your betrothed? Bana so shifa. 
Bakia Sunshi. Eh, da Allah. Talk. With all due respect, ma, if I may come in, I do not wish to interfere in your business, but I don't think Safi meant to disrespect you. All she wants is for you to give her a chance to choose her own husband. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma. It won't be fair for you to force on her a husband that will make her unhappy. Then the queen will shuru. The queen can about marriage partner. What do you know about marriage? Could you go? I was given a husband by my parents, and I never regretted it till today. Things have changed from your time, ma. Nowadays, with the advent of education, children now know their rights and what's best for them. What's good for them? How can they go? Mama. I like that. Ma Mama. Can you say any way in the lawyer name? Not say it all. So. And I help other girls fight against things like this. Yenzu Kuma, you want to force me to do those things that I tell them not to do. You don't care, you know? I care, Mama. So. You the back, you know, I regret you being a lawyer into. How can you? Kuma, I leave you to your pace, I feel not true. Ama, if you run into any problem, do not come to me. I will leave you to find a husband for yourself. When you find him, let me know. Hajia, what is the problem? I think we are here to talk sense to our head. Come what is the head. problem now? Am I the one that is going to marry you? She said she doesn't love you, Musa. What do I do? Come on, Musa, you have a wife, huh? Go back to your wife, Danla. Haba Musa, da Allah. Bana so unkafa. Tana de ma, ye na de ma ta ije de. Haji ali kuba. Me, me kana so yi. Okay, there's no problem. I let you hear this. Ejito. Allah to lie, Allah to hear this. Ejito. Musa. Okay. Ande ba Musa ah. Amu amu. Ah ha. Na go Jesus. Na Ejito. Ah ha. Ama de get the husband and bring home. Na chi mama. So. Ngo de. You never. I'm 